Hey, how's it going, y'all? Before we get into the box opening, just wanted to update the tier 10 people. Scooty messaged me saying that they're updating the quest thing, so we're no longer limited by the fern roots on every single month. But now the worst part is gonna be indeed the fairies. So I don't know how that's gonna be. Hopefully, people are just gonna sell fairies or the feathers. But yeah, if you wanna watch the video, more tier 10 information, I'll link it in the description. We get into the latent boxes, immediately got the dust from the first one, crons from the second one, sharp, which is beautiful because it doesn't sell ever, and then another sharp, which was fantastic because I was I was hoping for latent, but who needs latents? Then from the Karina uh, boxes, I got a uh, guardian and uh, dust. Then from the golden box, I actually got two sharps. Kafra bundles, I got 89 Kafras, which was RNG carried. From all the Oasis boxes, I got the only thing that mattered was Voltara. Then opened up a bunch of uh, Dark Rift boxes, and the only highlight that I have for you is beautiful Pry Orkinrad, which is magnificent. I don't usually get prize, so that was fantastic. Got a couple of crowns, opened up the Ancient Creature Seals, which the I made tons of video about it if you want to watch how you pretty much double your money every single time at least double your money opened up the golden bar box and i still only got 100 million i still can't get rg carry on that uh shikatsu boxes were awful i got uh i got sharps and i got memes memes were actually good the sharps is just ugh. and then i had three val bundles didn't get a val boys and girls spoiler alert did not get a veil. I got like 12 crowns. I think that's a pretty good, pretty good highlight, I guess. Then opened up the bait win boxes and I got myself 22 artisans, a desert fox, a beautiful premium outfit, which means that I can go for a pen attempt in this video. And then from the last one, another desert fox. Beautiful. And then I checked out the pre orders and I actually finally got a costume. Hell yeah, that means that we've got more pants and then sold both of the foxes for the U market. In total, I got 800 extra crowns. I forgot about the ancient artifacts from the current event where you can grind, gather, and fish all these items. And the best thing that I got was two crystals, Carmea and, uh, uh, oh, claw piece as well. And uh, yeah, that was pretty good. So I went with the 154 stack on a double attempt on Uragons, and I didn't get it. Then I went into enhancing, and the first thing, earring, didn't go. 70% by the way. Voltara went beautifully. Layton actually also went beautifully. So then we move on to Orc and Red. The duo Orc and Red, easy as that. So I was like, bro, this is actually turning out to be a great stream. A duo Voltara, yup. Dual Layton, yup, yup, yup. Try Orkin Red, yeah, no, no. Then try Voltara, easy, bro. And then, yeah, we hit two tries in a row. We made money, so I instantly sold the Layton, so we have money to enhance. And then I pushed the stack because I really wanted the 110 stack, so I raw attempted my Griffins, and then I attempted on a proper stack Ted Voltara. I think Telfazar is the only thing that I never gotten from the Ted accessories. Bro, why did I even raw attempt Ted Griffin, bro? It, it never went back! I wasted two bill! Then went to uh, Crown Moth and uh, I got two crowns. Then I also got pizza to feel better about uh, this whole spending two billion on Griffin helmet. Then I spent extra money on Blue, Mo uh, Blue Molar. I actually tapped uh, Rainbow Coral. Then uh, tried my luck with Tricitzels. Easy went to Tricitzels. I went for a Tet because I was trying to make some cash with that big stack. But we're just making the stack bigger. I got myself a dual forest, made it into easy try. And then I was like, well, time to make money. No money. I bought myself two more tries and we didn't get a try. The last try, and we didn't get a try. And that is how you lose all your money by enhancing, boys and girls. Don't do it. I should have just saved up some extra cash and just went for my, the mana's hole that I initially planned. I'm chilling at the new line house if you haven't seen it. It's a pretty cool spot, right? So today is Monday, 
yesterday i did the stream and today we got the pay to win box again actually i was surprised that they didn't give us the 100 mil again for some reason they only did it only once which is very weird yeah i got the five buck one half the price let's see if we can get something cool something dope also if you want my recommendations don't buy these there's nothing good in this usually they have like something actually special with a couple of i think previous box we had a blood outfit halloween outfit and a golden hedgehog or i think the the fox uh, item drop rate as you can see this one so this one doesn't contain any of those i don't know that's just my personal opinion i would not buy these if you want my recommendations i guess hopefully i'm not gonna get the tailoring coupon i'm hoping for some crons so i can attempt more pen attempts please hey 100 crowns let's go it's not gonna be enough for a pen attempt but i'll take it i'll take yeah. in total the box opening was pretty dope i think i got pretty much everything above average except the vels and all the top tier loot but i didn't really expect it enhancing session wise everything was fine until i decided to tap the griffin which i couldn't back couldn't tap it back to tat so kind of sad but you know it's enhancing it's gonna it's gonna do that so yeah i'm gonna have to focus on getting a bunch of money now because i don't know about na and other servers but those are actually now super pre-ordered like there's nine pre-orders on ten hoes so that's why i decided to sell or uh, attempt the tet voltara because uh, I was about to sell it and buy myself or the Tri or Ted Ho. But then I saw there's a bunch of pre-orders and I was like, oh, well, might as well try to uh, maybe make a pen. And that way uh, have some extra money for enhancing for Manos Ho. And then enhancing happened. Yeah, time to grind again for damn money. The amount of horses that I have prepped. Look at this. This is so much cash. Every single one of my characters is with a horse. So yeah, I've been I'm imperialing horsey with this event with the 50% extra speed all day, all night, unless the video crashes, then all day and not so night. I completely forgot Lina or Lina in my in my country. It would be Lina, but you send me a discord message. Thank you very much for the yo, everybody who uh, want to help out by literally doing this. I really greatly appreciate it because then the videos are much more clear and everybody gets provided the information so i do appreciate it very very much so linda provided basically more information around the uh, farm route as you can see the statistics for getting the how much you're getting pretty much the one thing that you have to notice is the training level apprentice skill specialist craftsman master etc uh, master would get four and uh, me i would get a three hopefully that info helps and thank you linda thank you very much well, Coral Ring is not selling overnight, so the old most obvious thing that you can do is enhance to a Tet. <sighs> probably won't sell as well, and I'm probably gonna waste a stack, but you know what? Sometimes you gotta say a good ending is required for a video. So I think the appropriate stack I think is uh, plus 70-ish. We got a 60 stack, we got 10 Valks, and we got a Discord message. Plus 25%, let me uh, guild it up. And what we got, 20%, gone. I got so many stacks, man. Oh, that's cute. Look at the cute, cute. Why does my cat lazy? Come on, cat, can you get on my back? Oh, did someone sold it? Yeah, someone sold it today. No! I'll try to get a pre-order today on the Ted Manos hoe. I did something silly that probably a lot of people will judge me, but I don't really grind as much, so I was like, uh, might as well pull the trigger. I removed some Kafras out of my dandy. I still have the 273 bracket. I technically just removed a couple of levels, and going hard for the tier 10 seems like a logical solution. And who brought a camel? Tier 9 camel when? Wait, I just leveled this horsey to a level 15. Which means I can Imperial it whenever the tier 10 update comes out. I have 19. Hey, that's a lot of horsies. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the box opening. Um, as you can see, I'm 271, 274. I'll try to get this back to Tet. Uh, maybe do like an enhancing session with some extra cash left out. 
hopefully you enjoyed enjoy the rest of your video uh just <laughs> enjoy the rest of your day i'm probably gonna go head to bed Ugh. okay and this is just sometimes that happens yeah bye bye